that last long day she said goodbye. Well, Lord, I thought I would cry. She do me, she do you, she's got that kind of love. Lord, I'd love to hear when she comes to sweet daddy. Welcome back, ladies and germs. I have returned for your pleasure. I know I haven't uploaded it in like a month. And I, will, I know all my uh, adoring fans have been dying for me to, to get in them proverbial cheeks with the proverbial penis that is an upload for me to pleasure your rectums. Honestly, I hadn't noticed how long it's been. Uh, I realized the other day, and I was like, oh, my bad. My dumbass uh, subscribers kept pestering me. So annoying. But I understand. And the truth is, I was actually on vacation with some of my boys. Uh, here's a picture of me that I took at the beach, so... There's the face reveal if you ever wanted one. Now you get to, to see how sexy I'm looking. Very sexy indeed. Hope you enjoy that. That's the last time I'll show my face. So keep that ingrained in your memories. When you hear my su smooth, silky voice talking into your ears, just imagine uh, that beautiful face. Anyway, we went to San Francisco. We cuddled in bed together in the sleaziest area by a lot of sketchy hooligans, lots of bums, and... Uh, it smelled really loud too, so it was probably the best vacation I've ever had, you know, in the sleaziest part of fucking town. Um, but now I'm back. I will be uploading more regularly <coughs> once a week. <laughs> uh, and uh, so, you know, let's let's just get with what I wanted to talk about this video. You've seen the title. Uh, they've reared their ugly heads. Their big ugly foreheads. Uh, what I wanted to talk about was the Battle of the Baldies. So I made a video a while back about how to acquire clout. Uh, and if you watch the video, which you definitely should, go watch it. Uh, you would know that the only way to acquire clout is to sell your soul to the devil and go bald. I mean, ba there's a few more steps, you know, but essentially going bald. Uh, now we've reached the pinnacle of clout on this godforsaken website. So Logan Paul, the baldest man alive, will be going head to head. Get it? Head to head? Because they're both, they're both bald. It's funny. Uh, with the with the black guy, um, this black guy over here who's apparently famous for um, being black, uh, being bald, who knows? But that's not all. The Logan Paul brothers, so both of them, they're both fighting. So Logan Paul's little brother Jake will be facing ag against uh, Beggy, or whatever the fuck his name is. He's KSI's fatter Littler, balder, and more degenerate brother. I mean, this guy just, this guy's a piece of work. Uh, now, I hate all these people. I really do. I fucking despise all of them. I wish they would all just drop off the face of the earth. But I honestly think this is kind of cool. It's a cool opportunity. Um, seeing a bunch of insecure, rich, bald men fighting each other brings warmth to my heart. It really does. I mean, the only th way to complete this would be to have a few more, a few more bouts, you know. Uh, I-dubs versus the Asian man would be pretty cool. Now, Idubs, he's bald as fuck. He's also gay, but mostly bald. Re pretty fucking bald. I mean, Idubs' hairline is just clapped. The definition of clapped. Uh, and, the, you know, the Asian man, he's not bald. Uh, he's not He's not balding either. But, you know, he does have a microcephalic penis, which is basically the Asian equivalent of being bald. Uh, and before you call me racist, I'm not racist. Uh, I'm not saying his penis is someone because he's Chinese, okay? I'm saying it because... I've actually been to the Cloud House, as uh, some of you know. Uh, we, I've gone there a few times because I, I live pretty close by. It's like a 10-minute walk from me. Uh, this one time I walked into the shower while he was in there, and his dick was pretty fucking small. I mean, he was even smaller than mine, actually. I remember it that way, at least. I mean, it might have been a little bit, like, the same size, but it's pretty small, okay? Which is pretty surprising, uh, except not really because he's Chinese. <laughs> Unfortunately, Idubs has AIDS, and he's a giant pussy. Uh, so he probably won't be doing the fight, uh, so I won't get to see that. Two lanky ass motherfuckers, you know, slapping each other or whatever. Well, you know, I mean, a Leafy would be cool too. Leafy versus Idubs, or a Leafy versus Ice Gum, or if, I mean, you could you could combine all three of them together and just have them sick sick go you know go at each other. That'd be cool too. But actually, Leafy's hairline ran away a while ago, um, and also having a corpse fight Idubs and Rice Gum that'd be kind of weird. You know, it'd be kind of tasteless. Although it would give Logan uh, Paul some more clout if if Leafy's corpse were to fight them. So that could be a great opportunity for everyone. Especially me, because I get to see it. Uh, the baldest man alive, Keemstar. 
Uh, that'd be cool to see him fight, but honestly, there isn't really a fat, balding, disgusting man-child with a sub-100 IQ and the vocabulary skills of a third grader with Down syndrome to go up against him. So it would kind of be hard to like arrange a fair fight, you know? So I think Keems are just out of the question. I'd like to see Face Banks get his ass kicked too, but unfortunately, all the monks are in Tibet, uh, and I doubt they'd come down for such a trivial manner, you know? A trivial matter, my bad. Uh, yeah, so I don't think we can find another monk to fight him. So Brother Banks is probably not going to engage in this. I think the fat man, uh, Nick Grumpton, <laughs> Nick Grumpton uh, is fighting some fat bloke from Australia or something. But honestly, who gives a fuck? I mean, just two fat people fighting each other. Like, that's not that interesting. I want to see the like bald people. Nick Grumpton's hairline isn't that clapped. And the other guy, I don't even fucking know. I'm not even going to bother putting a picture of him on this because I really don't fucking care. Um, but all the other ones, I mean, a man can dream, you know, I, I, I wish I could get those other dipshits to fucking beat each other up. Um, but anyway, on to the main event as when it comes to Logan Paul versus fr Kentucky fried chicken, um, usually the man with more clout wins. And if you watch that video I talked about, uh, that pretty much translates to the balder man will win. Uh, if we look at this picture of, of CSI, oh my, oh my God, holy fuck. Is that real? No, this is a... Is that real? Fuck. I did not realize how fucking bald he is. I mean, Logan Paul is bald, but... Holy shit! God damn! His hairline ran away faster than his father did to go buy milk at Walmart, but then ran uh, all the way back equally as fast to care for his family. Um, anyway, fuck, this man is bald as shit. And the balder man usually wins, but I gotta say, I think Logan might kill KSI. This is me being serious. I think he's going to fucking slap and, you know, just annihilate him. As much as I hate to admit it, Logan Paul's a fucking snack, okay? He's fucking way taller than Kentucky Fried Chicken here. And he's pretty beefy. Uh, he's also a really good kisser, I've heard. I've heard. I've never kissed him. Or I kissed him once. It was pretty good. Um, so, yeah, my money's on Logan. I think Logan is just going to fucking annihilate the kid, which sucks. I mean, it really does suck because I hate both of these retards, e like, equally. Like, not equally. I think, see, Logan Paul is a fucking uh, loud, obnoxious, arrogant asshole, and so is KSI. But Logan Paul is to KSI what Jake Paul is to a, like, a regular person. So, like, a billion times worse. Um, but, so, ideally, I'd like to see them both just kill each other in the ring. And then Keemstar dies of a heart attack while it's happening. Uh, and then everyone else in the audience and anyone else involved bites the dust. Well, I hope you enjoyed me making fun of these uh, rich, bald millionaires. Uh, if you enjoyed, you know, make sure to subscribe. Hit that bell notification. Um, I don't know what it does. It does something, I'm sure. Uh, leave a like. Leave a comment telling me. Leave a comment uh, telling me how gay you are on a scale of I dubs to I dubs, but twice as gay. Uh, tell your mom to hit me up on Facebook so I can butter her biscuits real quick. Uh, if you don't, if you didn't enjoy the video, uh, toss your stuff in the trash because dissent makes me really sad. And uh, yeah, it's, um, if anyone leaves a negative comment, I'm really gonna, I'm gonna cry. Uh, anyway, have a good one, bozos. Uh, I love each and every single one of you strangers that I don't know and will never meet. Goodbye. What are you doing? Like the pedal car? Oh, dude, oh, that's too fast! That's too fast! I couldn't turn off the nitrous, dude. I couldn't. You I were couldn't. running into a wall. Yeah, dude. I couldn't turn it off. I couldn't control the car when it's on it. It's like super fast. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. Beautiful dream.